Here are our weekly picks for this week. To recap, 56.3% versus 62.5% for the season. 9 out of 16 last week for the fans and 10 out of 16 for myself. Not too far off, so let's take a look at the results for this week. Week 2 of the NFL season kicks off with the classic NFC East matchup between the New York Giants and the Washington football team. For both teams, last week is something they want to forget. Not only did both teams lose, but Ryan Fitzpatrick will be out for multiple weeks. Can Taylor Heineke lead this team to victory tonight? According to the polls that we asked you guys on Instagram, 69, nice. Percent of you guys favor Washington in this game as opposed to 31% favor New York. Our pick? Let's roll with Washington. Transitioning into Sunday, the Patriots head to East Rutherford to take on the New York Jets. The Mac Jones era is off to a rocky start after last week's loss to the Dolphins, while the Jets will take the moral victory in knowing that Zach Wilson is going to be a great player in the NFL. Let's take a look at the polls and who do you guys believe is going to win? 78% say that the Patriots are going to win as opposed to 22% are favoring the Jets. Our picks? The Patriots. The Broncos play a second consecutive game on the road when they travel to the home of AEW to take on the Jacksonville Jaguars. Trevor Lawrence suffered his first regular season loss, while Teddy Two Gloves didn't look too bad. Unfortunately, he has to move on without Jerry Judy for the next few weeks. Taking it to the polls, 75% of you guys are favoring the Broncos, 25% are favoring the Jaguars. The Jaguars, as you can see, are the worst ranked team on our power rankings, but I'm going to go with the upset and favor the Jaguars at home. One of these teams is first place in the AFC East, and it's not who you think. The Buffalo Bills will face the Miami Dolphins. Miami looks like they picked up where they left off from last year, while the Bills look to rebound after a disappointing loss to the Steelers. According to the polls, 81% of you guys favor the Bills, 19% the Dolphins. I'm going to take the favorite of this and go with the Buffalo Bills. The injuries continue for the 49ers as they travel to the East Coast to take on the Philadelphia Eagles. San Francisco will be without Raheem Mostert this season. As for the Eagles, Jalen Hurts is continuing to prove his doubters wrong. We'll see if he's the real deal against a solid 49ers defense. And according to the polls, this is kind of close. 55% favor the 49ers, 45% favor the Eagles. I'm going to roll with the Eagles. The Los Angeles Rams versus the Indianapolis Colts. This is exactly what the Rams imagined when they traded for Matthew Stafford. Without question, they've become Super Bowl contenders. Whereas the Colts, who were decent last season, are still trying to rebound and get back into form. Looking at the polls, 90% favor the Rams, and it's not even close. The Colts only favored by 10%. I'm going to roll with a favorite and go with the Rams. Was it a fluke or are they legit? The Raiders face another top eight team in our power rankings and the Pittsburgh Steelers. Las Vegas is out to prove that they are real against another AFC North team. Pittsburgh is riding off the momentum of their huge victory against the Buffalo Bills. According to the polls, we're rolling with the Steelers. 63% go with the Pittsburgh Steelers as opposed to 37% for the Raiders. My pick, the Steelers. That offensive line didn't look too bad. The Bengals will take on the Chicago Bears. All of the doubt that we had about Jamar Chase and the drops seem to have been put to rest. For the Bears, in this revenge game for Andy Dalton, they continue to deal with the pressure of the fans wanting Justin Fields. According to the polls on Instagram, 62% are favoring the Bengals in this game, and only 38% have the Bears. I am going to take the Cincinnati Bengals. If you're going to call them the worst team in the NFL, they're going to make you eat your words. The Texans travel to Cleveland to take on the Browns. David Culley makes a statement in his first game as head coach. The Browns almost beat the Chiefs last week, so there's no reason to believe that they aren't playoff contenders. According to the polls, hey, this is kind of lopsided. 90% are favoring the Browns, 10% are not, uh, are going to favor the Texans and not really giving the Texans a shot in this game. I'm going to favor the Browns with my pick. Another team that made a statement, the New Orleans Saints. They faced the Carolina Panthers. The Saints blowing out one of the better teams in the NFL instantly makes them a team to watch out for. While the Panthers have all the tools available to be a great team, so let's see if they can hold up against the Saints. According to the Instagram polls, 82% are favoring the Saints, and only 18% have the Panthers. Kind of lopsided, I'm going to go with that 82% and say that the Saints are going to win. The Minnesota Vikings make the trip to Glendale to take on the Arizona Cardinals. Minnesota focused in on improving their defense this offseason, 
but it will be enough against Kyler Murray? That is the question. The Cardinals look great on both sides of the football. And according to the polls, 89% lopsided as well. Go with the Cardinals. 11% favor the Vikings. I'm going to roll with the Arizona Cardinals. NFC South showdown between the Atlanta Falcons and the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. The number one ranked team in our power rankings are heavy favorites, but the Falcons could contend with Tampa Bay secondary dealing with injuries. But according to you guys that voted, you say that the Falcons are not going to contend. 94% are favoring the Bucs and only 6% have the Falcons. My pick, the Buccaneers. Facing another talented NFC West team, the Tennessee Titans battled the Seattle Seahawks. Last week was one that the Titans want to forget, while Seahawks continue to display why they are a top five team in the NFL. Will Derrick Henry be a little bit more involved this week, or will Russ continue to cook? According to the polls, we're going with Russ. 67% are favoring the Seahawks, 33% are favoring the Titans. I am rolling with the Seahawks. Two high-powered offenses are set to put on a show. Dak Prescott and the Cowboys face Justin Herbert and the LA Chargers. The Chargers are coming off a big victory against one of the better defenses in the NFL, while the Cowboys held their own against the defending Super Bowl champs. According to the polls, this is a little bit closer, but a lot of you guys are favoring the Chargers, 59%, while the Cowboys and their defense continues to struggle, 41% in favor of the Cowboys. I'm going to roll with the upset in this game and favor the Dallas Cowboys. Sunday Night Football, the Kansas City Chiefs versus the Baltimore Ravens. It's a tough road for the Ravens at this point with a loss last week and in danger of going 0-2 this week. Meanwhile, the Chiefs are coming off a big victory against the Cleveland Browns. Who do you guys have winning in this game? 77% are saying the Chiefs are going to win, while 23% are going to favor the Ravens. I am going to take the upset, the Ravens at home, and go with them for my pick. And finally, Monday Night Football, the Green Bay Packers versus the Detroit Lions. The conspiracy theories are out there that Rodgers is intentionally throwing this season, but I have a strong feeling that his performance on Monday will put that theory to rest. It was a close comeback for the Detroit Lions, but they proved that they can stay in games when you count them out. According to the polls, we're going with the Packers in this game, 71% as opposed to the Lions, 29%. My pick, the Green Bay Packers.